By example, if you want to bake a cookies uh, at 310 degrees at for 13 minutes, okay, and then you want to beep for uh, 10 seconds at the end of the operation. You can use that programmation sheet, okay? You will see you have different settings, okay? You have zero zero for the steam, you have zero one zero zero for the auto steam, you have the buzzer that is zero zero ten, and you have no even that is zero zero zero. Basically that's the step you want to have on your recipe. So I told you three ten degrees for the cookies, okay? So I want three ten degrees. I want ten uh, I didn't say 10, 13 minutes, 13 minutes, and I want no even, so I would say zero, okay? Basically, I have no second step, okay? I want to use nothing there, but I have to confirm I want 310 degrees, but I can leave blank all other settings, okay? The last time I asked 10 seconds, okay, so I would say 310, that's my temperature I want, then 10 seconds, that's my buzzer and according to my even I want the buzzer auto steam buzzer 0, zero 10 so I say zero, zero, 0010 that's very easy when you have that information sheet already filled before to program the controller now I'm going to the controller itself I turn on the unit I have to keep press both K and I keep press both SP1 appear. I want to modify the recipe number two. The recipe number one is always the pre. -eat. It means as soon you turn on the unit, the unit goes on SP. You press number two, SP1. I go on my sheet. I say 310. So I use the up and down arrow, SP1, and I raise the value up to the right value. On my example, that is 310. So I raise the value. Oh, I pass through. Three ten. I want to go on the second step. That is the time. I have to press the recipe I'm editing. So I press number two, T one. I love the time to recovery zero zero. I want thirteen minutes. The same thing again. I use the up and down arrow. The time is rising. I said thirteen minutes because that's what I want. Thirteen minutes. I press two. E one. I want no even. You know, I told you if I want steam, I will use the same thing. I will press zero one for the buzzer. Uh, uh, zero one is for the steam. Sorry. Zero ten is for the buzzer. Eleven is for uh, basically they have no use for the 11 uh, 100 is for the auto steam but basically I want nothing I will just leave it blank so I will use uh, 0 0 0 okay I press 2 again SP2 set point temperature I have to reach it to 310 since that was my temperature you know you can set it at the temperature you want okay 2 3 3 or 1 2 310. I press number 2. Zero. Okay, I have no time because it's the recipe I have just 13 sec 13 minutes time. Okay, I press even 2. I'll leave it at 0 because I want nothing. I press 2. SP3, the set point again. I have to reach it up to 310 because that's my recipe. Then I press 2. Time. I want 10 seconds of beep. 10 seconds, then I finally press 2 for the third and last step. E3. I want a buzzer, so I go on my buzzer sheet. I say 0, 010, so I set it to 0, 010. And finally, when it's done, okay, I keep press 12 and then clock sign two time and the program is ready to use I press 2 and the time is decreasing when I want to stop an even I press 2 one time 
it stopped even but I have to go in preheat mode and I press one two time okay so two time will stop the timer and will leave the preheat mode on the unit that's my setting uh, how that's how you can set the uh, what low control